all right welcome back guys so before we start looking at the components that we can use to create an ionic page or to add content to an ionic page i wanted to quickly show you the official ionic um um website for all of its components so basically when you come to your um app toolkit click on the page ui component and you'll be on this page it's step five and i i want you to click on this link here so visit ionic docs for a complete list of components and just open that it will open in a new tab okay so basically it's this page is the official ionic page that contains all of the components that are you know available in ionic components are just you know things that help you build your page okay and add functionality to your page okay so there are quite a number of them like they are okay well not so much but there are different ways we can actually use all of these components to style our pages okay now many of these components like a number of these components you would actually need to know how to program to use them okay um but i have created a toolkit like this toolkit here this page ui component and i've you know brought out the common ones that you use to help you create content on your page and i have you know modified them and made them easy for you to apply okay so in the subsequent lectures i'm going to be making reference to these two app toolkits and we're going to be seeing how we can add components to our page um just by you know clicking to copy and then modifying the contents of the components on our app all right so i just wanted you to know that there is the official ionic page that contains all of the components and if you want to know more learn more about ionic you can actually come here and do your research all right so thank you so much and see you in the next video